here we have the elite. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Ah. This is fantastic. Oh, this, is, this is top notch. <laughs> you like the place? This is beautiful. This is exceptional. <clears throat> this is I know, right? Yes. It's good that you're finally home. Let me show you around. Trust me, baby. If I show you the bedroom, I know what you're going to do. You're just going to be like, wow, 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 wow. <laughs> you and your, your Come suckers. Come let me see you around. Let's go, let's go. That's the door. Let's go. Hey, we do find girl. Hey, sugar. Hey, how are you doing? I'm very well. Say hi to mommy. Hello, sweetie. Say hi to mommy. Say to mommy. Um, um, sweetie, are you not going to be joining me for our mommy exercise? Oh, you know the game. Chantel is already keeping me busy. Aren't you keeping me busy? Come here. I hope she's no longer running temperature like yesterday. No, she isn't. Uh, she's inside. Um, so she should come and give your mama her drugs. Please. Don't worry, I'll help her Make do sure that. Make sure she has her food. It's okay. Mm -hmm. It's okay if there's anything I need, I'll just call it to do it. Okay. Let me go. Make, Let me Make sure go. she takes her medication. All right. Okay. So you don't stay long, okay? All right. Tell mommy bye-bye. Say mommy bye-bye. Okay, say it. just look at mommy. Say mommy, bye bye. Okay, say mommy, bye bye. And come here. Mommy's gone. So now I always. This one for daddy. Leave me alone. I know you're the most beautiful creation I've ever set my eyes on. Trust me, you're going to brighten my day. Would you leave me alone? We're not quarreling. Anyway, my name is Mike. Go tell those that are ready to listen. Shh, rubbish. We're not quarreling. Say, hello. Jogging and I ignored you. Didn't that tell you I'm not in the mood to entertain useless chit chats? Just calm down. All I want is for us to talk. There's nothing to talk about. As you can see, I'm in my husband's house. My husband is around. He will not be happy to see a man like you here. Well, I definitely will not follow you into your husband's house. You dare not. There will be nothing to talk about. All right. Can I ask you for a favor? There will be no need. Kindly make a U-turn and get out of my husband's house. Get out!
out here. You again? Wait, 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 Mike. I thought I had already told you not to come anywhere around my husband's house looking for me again. What's your problem? Well, I was actually in the house and I thought it wise that I could come for the both of us to talk. Mike, there is nothing for us to talk about. If my husband should come back here and meet you, only the Lord knows what he would do to me and you both. I was outside. I saw when your husband drove out, so I know very well that he's not around. Let's talk. <laughs> really? <laughs> I see. So what do you want, Mike? Good. What do you want? Good question. Do you want us to talk here or do we go somewhere else? There will be no need for that, Mike. Go away and never return. My way out, as you can see. All right. Take your time. But just know that I will keep coming. I'll keep coming, okay? For 30 pieces of silver, Judas betrayed the 12 disciples of Jesus. How, how much is my loving husband willing to betray me for? <laughs> Sugar, why, why are you sounding this way? You and I know that no amount of money is big enough to betray the love I have for you. Not even some pieces of gold or silver. I love you deeply, baby. Nothing. It's, it's just that a lot of people do a lot of awful, awkward things to their loved ones nowadays. And my world is so built around you. I'm so attached to you. I do not want my heart to be shattered and broken into pieces. Come on. You know what? I promise you, I will never hurt you. Okay? Victor. Victor, you are God sent. Victor, Victor, you are you're a good man. You're one of the kind. And I, I promise to remain faithful and loyal to you in this marriage till, till it do us part of it. I cross my heart. I'm also going to remain faithful to you till the end of time. Can I ask you a question, Victor? Sure, go ahead. We're talking already. What if... What would take my beautiful wife away from me? Perhaps the call of nature, my darling. Baby, don't say that. Do not speak about death. It's not yet your time. Come here. I want to assure you something, okay? The both of us, we are going to live together as husband and wife. I am never going to break your heart. Okay? I love you so much. It's gonna be the both of us till the end of time. You go nowhere. Okay? I love you. Thank you, baby. You're the best man in the whole world. Come here. Thank you, my darling. Um, sweetie, mm -hmm. I 
I was going to tell you that I was going to take Chantel for her immunizations and I'll be going in for a comprehensive medical checkup tomorrow just for your consumption so you know. Okay, we're going to the hospital for a comprehensive checkup. Uh huh. Are you thinking what I'm thinking? Victor, come on. He's not Victor, come on. What if you just get there and the doctor finds out that you are pregnant? Victor, I'm sure you're just joking right now. Don't be sarcastic. Come on. <laughs> I'm not being sarcastic. It's impossible. Uh, mommy, sweetie, you want Maybe. some more biscuits? Uh, but we're not changing this topic. What I'm trying to say is, what if you get to the hospital and the doctor confirms that you are pregnant? Victor, that is not happening even in a thousand years. Does please. it mean I'm not active ah. enough in the other Who room? said so? Stop dwelling in your sarcasm, Victor. I will give my darling daughter a sister. <laughs> That's not going to happen. Please. It's going to be a boy, baby. Please, don't disturb. I am my daughter. We are eating. <laughs> okay, okay, table manners. We are eating. Okay. <laughs> Baby, do you want those? You want some more tea? Mm -hmm. boo, 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 boo. Mm -hmm. You again, Mike? I thought I warned you not to show your hideous face anywhere around the four walls of my matrimonial home. I thought I warned you. I thought we've closed this case. Carol, can you calm down and let us talk? I will not calm down. Hell no, I won't. Because I've warned you severally. Don't do this, Mike. Do not break my home. Carol, you could just so try and understand me. I mean, the there is nothing to understand. I will not sit here and watch you talk, Babash. As you can see, before you started, I was on my way out. Excuse me. Fine, you want to jam me, right? I'm gonna run over you if you don't get out of there! I'll stand here. Do what you want, I'm going nowhere. What sort of madness is this? I can see you've lost it. You're a total psychopath! Why you don't want me to go anywhere? I forfeit the outing! Get the hell out! to know let's let's leave the past where it belongs you had better stop talking because i swear to god if you do not tell me the truth i am going to do what the both of us will regret right now do you understand please darling okay okay mike mike is to be mike is to be my lover and ex-boyfriend in those days before we met and got Finally got married. I, I, I swear to God, I, I will never li lie to you, Carol. You just go ahead and listen to yourself. Please, Victor. Believe For how long me. have you been seeing Mike behind my back? Oh my God, I swear with everything I have, Victor. I don't know that man. I've not been seeing him. He's only my. Stop lying! <laughs> Better stop lying before I squeeze you right now. <laughs> now I am going to ask you this. I will ask you this once and for once. Can you tell me the truth? Who is the father of Chantal? Marcy. At the count of three, I need you to say the truth. Who is Chantal's father? Of, of, of course it's you. 
I won't. I won't lie. I won't lie to you. You are the liar. If you are on the time, lie. I won't lie to you. Lie to me. Oh my God. No, the liar. <sighs> Mike, what are you doing here? Carol, we have to talk. Do you want to ruin my marriage? My husband is at home. Why? Why are you doing this? Carol, we have to talk. Mike, you can't stand here, please. And I don't want to talk about my past. My husband. That is, is the reason why you left me. That is the reason why you run away into the hands of another man. Mike, don't even go there. Don't even go there, Mike. I know how. I know how many nights. I know how many years. You stayed living with the notion that you were no more. I looked for you, Mike. I searched for you everywhere. You were nowhere to be found. I lost my sanity. I, I was virtually a vegetable. You would have waited for me. You would have waited for me and now you are pregnant for another man. Oh my God. How, how did you know I was, I was pregnant? Nelson, Nelson did this, Nelson, Nelson, Nelson you've seen me. Carol, in as much as I understand what you are going through, you starving yourself is not the best way to go about all this. Look, don't forget, the police has assured us that they will find him and they will bring him home. You don't have to starve yourself. This, this was the same old story the police gave us months ago, Nelson. The same freaking old story. Could it be that there's, there's something you people are not telling me? There's something you people are not telling me. No, 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 
Carol, don't say that. <sighs> the police will find him and bring him home. Just, just them. Wait. Don't you think going to a media house to declare him missing officially would be the best bet right now? It will be the best if you ask me. But the police have not given us a go ahead to do that. We have to wait for them to give us a go ahead. Nelson, we do not need the orders or the consent of the police to go and report about my missing husband to be. It is my husband to be we are talking about here! Oh, okay, well, calm down. Relax. Relax and calm down. Let's give the police a week or two. Let's allow them some time. Then, if they don't come up with anything meaningful, we can go to the media house. <laughs> Relax yourself. Don't overwork yourself, okay? Calm down. No, Sin. Calm down. Just calm down. It's my friend, so I'm done. No, I'm finished. Calm down. Don't work yourself up for distance. <laughs> I'm sorry. I have a bad news. <laughs> don't, don't tell me Mike is no more. Don't even, don't even say it. Because I won't buy it. Don't. Don't tell me Mike is past tense. Don't. Carol, you have to be strong for what I'm about to tell you. The police found my lifeless body this morning. It's, it's a lie! It's a lie! Tommy! Tommy, it's not true! Tommy, it's not true! Carol Mike is dead. Carol! Carol! Somebody help me! Carol! Carol, please, please don't die! Carol, please! Somebody help me! Carol! Carol, please don't die on me, Carol! Somebody help! Carol, please! Carol, Carol! Carol, please! Carol, please! Mike! 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 Mike left! With, without saying... Without saying a single... A single goodbye! Not, not even a word. Mike vanished. The twinkle of an, of an eye. M Mike, how could, how could you, how could you, how, how, how could you, when, when is, is a, a born offspring exists in me? How? How could you do this, Mike? Are you... Are you pregnant? Yes. I was... One month pregnant. Yes. Do, does he know about it? I... I wanted to... I wanted to... This to him, but this to him. Mike, 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 how, 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 how could you do do this? Mike, Mike left. Mike didn't say a word. Mike. I know 
that child you have in there is my child. Now go in and bring my child for me. Mike. Mike, get off my house. Get out. There is no way I am leaving this compound without you. Mike, whatever you and I had stays in the past. It's dead and buried. I am not leaving this compound without you. For heaven's sake, we had a future going on for us. Get out of my house. I don't want him to come out and meet you here. Why get out? Use the gate. Why go? Go, get out. Why you will get out of my house? In my house. What is it? What is the problem? Nothing. Are you sure? I'm fine. Make any moves, I will stop you to death. I'll go down on your nails. What is? What are you talking about? Go down on your nails. At first, I came here like a gentleman, and what do I get? Nothing. I, I don't understand what you're saying. Will you shut up? You're only going to talk when I want you to talk. You think you can come from no way and claim what belongs to me, right? That baby. That is my child. And I'm not leaving this compound without them. I, 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 seriously, I, I don't understand what you're trying to say. That's my baby in you there. You're joking, right? No, no, please, please. I, I beg you in the name of God, don't, don't do this. <laughs> please. I don't know what you're saying. I know that was where I lost contact with her. And you came from nowhere and want to claim what does not belong to you. But you know what? I am going to give you a very slow death. I'll make you kiss the ass and say goodbye. I am not afraid. There is absolutely nothing to be afraid of. If killing me will make you happy, just go ahead. Right. You saved me. 